to the Genesis Principle Fine Arts. I'm Alton Jones. Today I'm sharing with you a little bit of my method of prepping some of the surfaces that I work on. Today I'm working on uh, canvas, cotton canvas in particular. That's what I'm using today. So I'm just staining the surface here or you can say toning the canvas but not just for the sake of color also for the sake of texture. So my staining is a little bit thicker that way when it dries it gives me a smoother surface to work on where I don't need to sand at all it's just ready to go straight away for paint so I'm sure I thought I'd share a little bit of that with you just in case you might be trying to find another way to have your surfaces ready and you don't really want to labor over into the the sanding process this is one way you can keep your surfaces smooth and prepare them for paint and the uh, the ingredients are pretty simple I'm using some odorless mineral spirits and mixing that with a couple of oil tones of oil oil colors and you can use whatever color you choose of your own choice I'm using some um, Van Dyke Brown titanium white and a bit of uh, Prussian blue mixed together just to give me the type of tone that I want and also it'll give me a nice coverage where I'll have a smoother surface when it dries so I thought I'd share some of this with you uh, as far as the visuals go I'll try to keep myself out of the way so that you can see exactly what's happening and um, yeah we'll go from there but this is my way of prepping a canvas for paint or toning or some would say staining, but it's a bit more than toning and staining. Uh, it's it's more prep work because it, it also prepares the, the quality of the surface and not just giving it a color. the quick look at what you should end up with at the end of your your toning and um, 
I'd call it surfacing, surfacing your canvas. It's a bit more than just toning or staining, so I'd say it's surfacing because you're increasing the smoothness and the thickness of your surface that you'll be painting on. So at the end of it, you're trying to achieve a surface that has no blemishes, no spots. And if you do find yourself in a situation where the canvas dries and you missed a few, a few particles that fell in, fell on it, or maybe were mixed into the mixture that you used, then just simply take a, a small piece of sandpaper at about uh, 220 grade and just hold, hold that over your index finger and just lightly sand real quick just to rub out the imperfection in the surface but you should end up with a perfectly smooth surface that's ready to paint on and if you want a little bit of texture in your surface reduce the amount of of a toning solution that you use on the surface to texture it okay so that's my idea of toning staining and surfacing a canvas Thanks for watching.